No secret. I was just a big kid and scared to death. How could I take care of either one of you? I could probably take care of myself. It's okay. I know you were a secret agent or something. <laughs> Where'd you get an idea like that? Well, I don't know. I just sort of you know, figured it out. <laughs> well, you figured wrong. I was just a snot-nosed kid with a played-out eight-track of the Allman Brothers catching sunlight on my dashboard. There was no reason? left because you felt like it oh come on son what's past is past all this time i thought you were saving the country you were just running away hey i came back to make it up to you come with me you're old enough to ride right here in my hip pocket without slowing me down you and me town to town bar to bar in and out of scrapes like a couple of compadres compadres Hey, kiddo, it gets downright lonesome on the road. We can kick some butt, take some names, paint the country red. There was a time when I really would have jumped at that. But let me just fill you in on something. I was on the street for three years, eating out of a dumpster and scared to death I'd get beat up, or worse. Every night, I hoped and I prayed that you were looking for me. You were gonna find me. Here I am. You're too late. Mike was the one who found me. Mike put a roof over my head. Mike put his arm around me and told me that I was smart. And told me that it was okay to care. He gave me a family. I'm your family. That's why I tracked you down. <laughs> no, you didn't. The Bureau of Child Welfare had to track you down. If they hadn't, you'd still be God knows where not giving a damn about me. I care about you the only way I know how. I got a spare seat and an extra sandwich in the glove compartment. I want you right there beside me. What do you say? <laughs> Luke, what's going on? Hey, can a guy give another guy a hug without everyone getting the heebie-jeebies? Come on, Mike. Let's go home.